Oh, I'm in charge of the TV. Okay, here we go. The story you never knew about Retro City. Hey guys, Retro here. And we're going to kick it off with this, this epic start. To start off with, Retro City Episode 4 is in the making. So if you're all excited for that, that... This is to explain the story so far, because episode 6 is coming up, which is the mid-season event. Hope you all are ready for that. So, episode 1. We'll start from 1. Episode 1. It's supposed to be the ex... If I, I should have named it the Escape. Retro City Episode 1, Season 1, Escape. Or Retro City, parentheses, Escape. See, Episode 1, Season 1. Whatever. That's supposed to be the Escape from my the lab, which I've been captured in for 3 months. Lot there, that's episode one. So, nose ring though, the villain of the episode. Why did I name him nose ring? I called him nose ring for purposes. No one, I'll have to show you the mask later. But the mask that he was wearing had this, had these wires all around it, and one was right here. So I'm like, nose ring. Oh, I, I, oh, it was like nose ring, pin it nose ring, or something like that. I don't know. I forget what I said. So that was supposed to be him stopping from destroying the park of Santan Junior High. I don't. It's not really the park of Santan Junior High. It's um the red yellow park. If you don't know where it is, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Um. But they were like studying on me, which this is gonna be a huge twist in season two. Which is almost coming. Guys, think about it, you gotta get ready. I want you to plan to watch all the episodes if you're like if you're one of those big hard die hard fans, you know. Not what I mean. Not die hard. If you're one of the most biggest fan of mine, I want you to watch every single episode. As if you're watching every single video of mine. And if, okay, but I'm not going to get to my outro yet. Then episode two, episode two, people got a little confused because there was, like, barely any, there was, to me, that's, like, the boring episode of the show. There's nothing to do with it, but it's not supposed to be. It's supposed to be, like, the Valentine's Day special that wasn't released on Valentine's Day. But that's also introducing the villain of three, four, three, four episodes, two, three, four. Three part episode. That's it, as you can see in the end. But there, there we go. Now we're going to start with this 11 minute episode. I have to go through every detail in this episode because it's the longest. Mixed in with the one where people got nauseous on <laughs> I didn't get very nauseous on this episode. I just, it looked good to me. So, starting up. First part, me waking up in the bed. That, that right there, that scene right there was supposed to be like, oh, Retro's not where he's at anymore. Or someone kidnapped him or what. Which I was, when I was suited up, I didn't show it. But in the last scene, I was bonked in the head. And it was supposed to be in episode two, but it wasn't there. So I woke up in this bed, and I'm curious, wait, where the hell am I? What am I supposed to do? Where am I going? Then Connor was introduced, which I introduced him a long while back. Back in the Assassin's Creed number one, trailer number one, I should say. Which I didn't end up making any Assassin's Creed yet until I introduced Connor in episode three. Which is the first Assassin's Creed character there is. It, 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 besides the Master Assassin. Besides the Master Assassin. Which, Master Assassin is supposed to be cool. He'll be introduced in episode 5, four, sixes, five sixes. But the episode of episode... And then, so as that conversation going, it's supposed to be introducing details of the sword... Which, I did a horrible job explaining all this, and yet, this is the best way to explain it. Um, so, 
as we go on, as we continue the story. And the next one in line is, the next detail in line is, the shadow creep, is where am I at in the back, why am I in a, some random person's backyard? Because it's supposed to look abandoned. That's why the grass is all long. I didn't do it, we, we just all lawn power broke, to be honest, so we haven't mowed it in a while. So, there's that. And so we're gonna continue, and that we just continued, I continued off that, looking for the Sword of Time, which is important. That's the sword. I want you guys all to remember that. That is important to the show. But the shadow creatures are also important for an epic crossover event between Spider Boy from who's ever, um, Tycoon Masters, Eli Morris, whatever. Description. <coughs> Link to his chan channel will be in the description below. But. What else? The shadow creatures are going to be this mega crossover event between mine and his shows. Actually, so there already is. Episode 2. Who the hell are you? Thing. Where he comes out of that thing. Oh, okay. Hey, I'm good. Okay, let's finish this video. And then, I find this jar and there's this little joke I make. Saying, oh, look. What is, wait, what is the joke? Let me think of the joke. I remember the joke. I could cut their lawn with this because as I was messing around, practicing the scenes, I was swinging the sword at the ground, and as hard as I was swinging it, the grass would just snap in half. Oh, I was, so I had to make a little joke to me messing around. Then, next scene is the bandana. The reason why I added a new bandana, a new color scheme for Retro, with the, instead of black bandana, as you can see in episode 1, and no bandana in episode 2, the red bandana is supposed to be a nod to I lost my black bandana and also to red bandana as my um as Miss Penlin would say if you're in her class the guy who saves lives on but risked his life doing the impossible a normal human being who can't who's not like a super inhuman not a story a real fictional character guy who no a non-fiction guy. He's not fictional. He's real. He was real. But he risked his lives in 9-11. So it was supposed to be like his... My honor to him. Mixed in with the fact that I also lost my black bandana. So I found the red one. So. Two pluses. And then... Then the fight scene. It was a big glitch D. Because I was so out of sync with it. I need to have some guy in the in like the suit, and then I have to voice over by making two clips. But it was supposed to be like, uh, it was a good fight scene. I it was good, but it looks like a TikTok video in my in my videos. I, I was expecting like the flash just to merge the videos with none of that line in between. Where if I did that, my arm would go there. So like if I did that, and there was this clip right here, if we merged the clips together, my fist would go right over there, and we're finished. Finish, and I would hit the guy. Guys, that's over there. That's what I was trying to do. But the person who edited that clip didn't know what I meant. I hope that he understands them. Now, but... Ugh, it, it, like that. The glitch, re and then the end. As, as everything's all glitched and then comes to this end clip to right here where everything's not glitched up. People doesn't, didn't understand why because I forgot to add in this clip, but what? Oh, so tired. What actually happened was Connor did this to my, to my head. So he was like this and he said, free your mind. And my mind went all free so I didn't see glitch. It, it's a complicated, and and yes, there was a delete, there's a deleted scene that I deleted off my phone, but of me eating the lasagna that I made in the first episode, and that and okay, that was a little 
So, I actually do eat the lasagna from episode 3. Um, but... As you can see, if you are a big fan of Assassin's Creed, Connor didn't have hidden blades. Mainly because I don't have money to buy even one gauntlet. Because the the cheapest one is about 20 bucks, and it's the cheap black flag one. That, like, it looks all horrible. Well, it looks physically, you can bend it, and it doesn't, it's just bent. But, uh, I can't do it. So I'm changing to get a new gauntlet. I think it's the um it's I think it's um from a syndicate. I'm gonna go with just that one. But it's the um just a recreation of um what's his name? Um Jacob's gauntlet. Jacob's gauntlet. But that's it for the, that's it for now. Hope you guys enjoyed. Yeah, and I'll see you in the next one. Later.